Borstal by Atthotep and at Regisikipol, which I believe are also Twitter accounts. So, um, you know, you can go ahead and take a look at those if you really feel like it. Yeah, those are Twitter accounts. Anyway, hey guys, Game Hunter here, and we're looking at another game in the 7 Day Roguelike Challenge of 2013. And we get to select the only campaign existing on this 7 Day Roguelike Challenge in 2013. And that is Borstal. It's the main campaign. So we get click click again to start. Oh, click this again to start. I see. Okay. Um, it's 1926 and you're 13 years old. You live in a town on the shore of England. It's a Borstal, a youth detention centre. I, I know it's it's centre. I just when I see that I always think French. I don't know why. It, it's it's Latin. Th I don't, why am I? Uh, anyway. There's a boar still located on a small island nearby. Your father works there. He didn't return home last Friday. Well, what's t today? Mom says he's probably drinking with his friend in the island, but you, you don't believe it. There's a supply boat that goes off to the island every second day. Every other, whatever. And you get used, and you used it to get there. So we need to find out what happened and find our good old pappy. What if I head back? Oh, really? <laughs> so it just does that. Okay, let's start. There's a crate filled with food and other supplies. Okie dokie, then. Let me just make sure I've actually clicked the screen. Um, wait. Oh, these are our these are the inventory bits. Um, crate filled with... Well, can I just pick up everything? I don't know. I guess not. I mean, I... Can I just keep going here over and over again? So it's except it's very much nighttime. If I use yes, use the match. Oh, that's right. I don't have wood to make a campfire. I was kind of hoping for the weather gets worse, and you begin to wonder if it was a good idea to come here at all. You think of home and delicious and mom's delicious cheesecake. <laughs> yeah, let's go ahead and rest. And now I'm hungry, so we eat the food. Use that food. What does this mean? I have a fever? I guess in the rain it would suck. Man, where is anything? Everything on this island seems to be abandoned, and the glimmer of hope abandons you as well. What did you expect coming here? I'm not really sure, indeed. I guess we're just going to go ahead and rest. And, and rest again? You feel sick. Maybe I know that, but where is safety? Your mat box of matches makes them completely useless. Well, that's fantastic, isn't it? Can I use the lantern? Oh, great. So you need wood to start it and everything, and bits and pieces there. Man, I'm just constantly requiring things. This is pretty nasty. Like, did, did I just... Yes, whatever, I don't care. Did I just happen to miss everything? Is this it? Lots of old planks. Finally, I found some wood. <laughs> Seriously. Yes, I know. What is this explore button? Oh, oh, that's that's our wait button, basically. I see. And so if we get all the way here, we can pick up matches. Use the matches. No? Maybe? I don't know. Let's try it. Oh, because it's raining. Huh, again, well, do bandages make me less... Oh, okay, they don't. Okie dokie, I was just making sure. Just making absolutely sure. Yes, the sickness, it continues. But I don't know how else to do anything here. Uh, yes, on the box of matches. And I keep getting so very tired... Um, no. Yes, I know. I need to eat. Eat that food! Okay, there we go. And now let's go ahead and try climbing this. So what, that just showed me a little bit of what's to come? You hear someone walking nearby. Let's try to hide. Okay. You don't want to go there, believe me, says the first boy. Second one gives him a weird look and pulls him away. Well, that's just fantastic. Man, the, the sickness just keep Ah, crap. I don't have food this time around. 
Oh. I won't go back there. I'm not. <laughs> but the things that are going on. Yes, okay. So. Where is this? Bo bo borstal. That hurts. Ow. Oh, man. I'm all half dead. Let's enter that house. Uh, let's search it. I'm dead. Let's try again, then. Oh, goodness. Um. I mean, is it going to be raining all the time? Because that's, that's just kind of annoying. Ow. Indeed, ow. <laughs> but I am wounded, aren't I? Isn't that, wasn't that the problem? So I guess it just constantly rains. Constantly. Investigate. Wait, but I didn't try to hide. I don't know. That was weird. Oh, there's the there's that. Okay, good. Enter that house. Let's search it this time. You find a knife in pretty good shape. Um, I can probably get rid of the food. I don't know. Oh, but now I have to use the food. Fantastic. Well, we can go ahead and search it again. Some aspirin tablets. Sure, why not? That probably heals stuff. Anything else in here? Nah, we don't need it. I don't really want to select. I guess I could select it to replace it with this again. And then we'll just try to rest here. You didn't manage to fall asleep. The omnipresent decay made you feel uncomfortable. Fantastic. Ugh. Indeed. I don't know what would be the point. Ugh. Cough. Aspirin to fix my cough. Shiver goes down your spine. What if you die on this island? How, will, what, how would it be to die of hunger and exhaustion? All right, so now we have another house. Search that house. It happens. We'll try again. Anything? Ooh, a jar of apple jam. Delicious. Let's try again. See what else we can find. Nope, nothing. Anything else this time? A lantern, but I already have a lantern. No, I don't want to use it. Although I'd love to be able to actually make use of anything. Fine, we'll rest and eat the jam. It's amazing how food miraculously also fixes... Ow. Miraculously fixes the, the whole problem. Everything looks so similar. Where am I? Oh, great. Really? You knocked me... Oh, good. Small pack of wood. Um, ah, darn it, it's raining. And I'm almost dead somehow. Bandages? Bandages. Oh, I'm not wounded. So what's, is it just the sickness? Maybe just the sickness. No, it wasn't the sickness. That certainly feels, oh, um, <laughs> yes, let's go ahead and attack with a knife. Wow, really? I just killed a dude. That was... I really wasn't expecting to get a kill. I'll tell you that. <laughs> I will tell you that. Um, we'll leave it. Actually, for the time being, I'd like to start a campfire. And maybe use the ma the lantern. There we go. Look at that. I finally made this work. I can't believe it. Oh, come on. we got to get something useful. Like a jar of jam. No, I don't need the knife. I don't need the knife. I need the jar of jam. Oh, well, whatever. Let's try resting. There's no more oil in the lantern. Well, that's no good. I guess... Yes. Oh, and I'm very hungry. That's no good. <laughs> that's no good! Oh, in that particular lantern, I see. That was the problem. But, well, I guess we'll drop this one, because it has no use. But we need to totally find some jam in here. There we go. And eat it! Ah, uh, yes, again, with the wild berries. Let's just go ahead and eat them. Oh, did I finally find the borstal? There we go. Man, that took me long enough. Something really bad happened here. There's blood on the floor. You were shaking. Let's go to the basement. 
Let's go to the gym. For some reason, all the tutors and caretakers are here. You recognize a few of your dad's friends, and behind them you see your dad himself. They're all... Oh, jeez. Oh, congratulations. <laughs> congratulations. But it was too late to save him. So we just... Wait, does that mean... Oi. Huh. I'm almost wondering... Okay, so Lantern seems pretty useless. <laughs> Makes more sense to stock up on lots of food and some bandages. And then just see if we can't find the Borstal as soon as possible. Yeah, whatever. Just... sure. Enter, search... A course. Sur yeah, let's search it. A rather advanced age. Yeah, let's take the knife. Whatever. And again, I don't need that, so whatever. So I guess I'm really just going to hope I find Ow. Really hope I find what I'm looking for. And, you know, hope it doesn't constantly rain or something. That, that seems to be a constant problem in these games. Yeah, the rain seems to really make the spirits go. Oh, ah, you got to be kidding me. So the aimlessness... Wait. Hmm. Perhaps I do need a lantern. Like, absolutely. Oh, ah, uh, sorry. Let's rest. And get some food. But it's already so many days later. Let's enter the house and search... I guess, oh man, is there a way to start over? I don't know. It's like cough, cough, yeah, whatever. I'll just wait till I get buggered, I guess. I don't know what the word is there. So I do need a lantern use, it seems, because I think when you get close to the borstal, if you don't have it, you get knocked back. So that's a problem. But I need to get a bazillion's foods, and then I need to find wood. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's just a bird. It's just a bird and nothing else. Search. It happens. Try again. Search. Whatever. Get the knife. Got the knife. Good. We need to find some... No, I don't care about that. Just rest. Which, apparently, they didn't... He didn't mind that there was a corpse... Oh man, I've been I'm really getting hit by these bandages this time around. Come on. Okay, finally I found some old planks. And what is it? A a cave. Goodness. I did not think I would be finding caves in this video game. Let's try again. Um I guess I could take a second one. Um so let's see. We have Wood, yes, yes, and then use it to start the lantern. Ah, man, really? Uh, don't care. So this is that house, and then we go find... So, I mean, you know, this is just stuff that's... Man, I don't really need knives. <laughs> it's just whatever. But the lantern doesn't last for very long. Okay, there we go, finally. So I got here faster this time. Wait, what? What, how? You enter it. Um, but I guess cut the rope. Yeah, and then we run. You managed to leave and call the police. Now you can, yeah, okay. So that seems like that was potentially the problem was that I didn't get there fast enough or something like that. It seems like there's a number of conditions that can change the game and how it works. I don't know. But it's kind of cool. Um, it's a weird way to play a roguelike. I think I heard this one as a somewhat of an interactive fiction game. But, I, I mean, I can see how this kind of plays out as a roguelike. Instead of having combat as the focus, it's instead about making decisions that affect the story. And I think if you made that complicated enough, you could really make a cool, a very cool roguelike. And this is a good prototype for that, if nothing else. 
Because you do have to make some decisions as to how you're going to approach the game and what you have and things like that. Although it would be nice to have maybe meters, I don't know, but that's more of a it's more of a UI thing. Anyway, this was fun. I enjoyed it. Uh, although I don't think I would play it for more than half an hour tops, but still, it's cool. And for seven day roguelike, that's pretty good anyway. So this has been Game Hunter playing Borstal. Uh, join me next time when we play another game in the seven from the seven day roguelike challenge of 2013. Until then, keep playing those roguelikes, guys, and take care.